helps me get ready for game time would be one that um, starts off slow probably with a lot of static stretching, moving into some dynamic stretching um, to get the muscles really going and then something that involves the ball, honestly. The warm-up that helps me get ready for game time is a lot of band work, um, a lot of activation exercises for my glutes, um, and single leg stability holds. Before warming up with the team, I always try and activate my core, uh, my glutes, my hammies, just everything kind of to get loosened up to prevent injuries, really. I like to emphasize my calves and my hamstrings, make sure they're nice and warmed up before I, I hit the pitch because they tend to get a little tight and cramp up on me. So to make sure that doesn't happen, I like to make sure I warm them up right. I usually start with like some band work, um, like activation stuff, um, but a lot of stability work. Um, also just getting the muscles warm, a lot of running and um, change of speed, change of direction, like get me ready for the game. I come to the fields, I do a lot of dribbling, like a lot of work with the ball, just fast footwork, um, jog up and down the field, just get my muscles loose, stretch my hamstrings because they're usually tight, um, and you know, just kind of get the jitters out, yeah. The warm up that helps me get ready for game time is just a series of activation of um, all of my muscles and then uh, getting on the ball. The warm up that helps me get ready for game time is we do a lot of band activation, so just anything with the band like crab walks, monster walks, that type of stuff. The warm up that helps me get ready for game time is usually foam rolling. I love it. <laughs> um, I really like to foam roll my T bands, which is usually what hurts everyone, but it makes me feel, feel better. <laughs> There's a few different warm-ups we like to do for the players uh, pre-game, but you know it's very important that we tailor our warm-ups for what the player needs. So each player will have their own specific needs throughout the game, but really what we'll look to do is make sure that we activate the muscles, we raise the heart rate, and we, we put them through some different dynamic movements that really cover every important muscle that they will use throughout the game. And it's all about injury prevention. As much as it's important to ensure we're ready for the game, we also want to prevent injuries from becoming something that's consistent within their play.